what's happening? You know, so it's not my job to track you down and hunt you and be the conscious police, you heard me? But once I catch you with your hands in the cookie jar, it really does, for me, signify that um, I got to sound the alarm. We in a war right now, and every move is critical and pivotal. And so, if you think I'm going to sit back and watch you mistreat our people, and not say it on every corner, then you got me mistaken. And I have a right to do that if you're not being who you say you are. Now, if you want to come make issue of that, now that's all on you. But telling the truth ain't never hating. And if I don't do nothing else before I leave this planet, I'm going to always exclaim that fact. Telling the truth ain't hating. If you can prove contradictory behavior, and ain't no subjective, I don't like them type stuff. And you feel like you want to tell me or any other friend you have for their protection? Then that's what it is. I don't care if you like the dude or a female or if you think they cool. And then what makes it so sad with most of y'all, all you really have grasp of is the frivolosity of a tabloid appearance. You heard me? You don't even really be knowing Omar Johnson and stuff. And when people from your own city tell you what they saw in real life, in real time, you'd rather be in love with the romanticism than listen to the person that you grew up with. Even though they have empirical data. That is an Achilles heel for our people. You heard me? And it's something that until we learn how to counteract that, we are doomed. We can't have no fruitful movement without first a calling, a role calling, and then a calling on contradictions. And our most adept and brightest can then be seen for who they really are. And I say that meaning a lot of them skirmishes out there that left me with residual damage and people stop supporting this and that. If you only really knew the truth, you'd despise that person too. And you would have taken the same stance. But you've only heard the aesthetic posturing. You've only heard the hearsay. So I want to end this video by saying anyone in any city, in any state, in any parish, county, or country, in any continent on this planet... That I have had any kind of discourse with, I'm willing to have them on Zoom, Facebook Live. We can invite me in. Let's tell people what the real deal was if you think you got a real case. And let's let the chips fall where they may. How many of y'all out there real enough to do that? Because I got a fierce allegiance. And for y'all watching, you are who you rock with. And everybody that crossed my path definitely knows quit playing when a nigga's definitely, seriously, obviously serious. Upset the setup, man. You are who you rock with. Southern Wall, dope popping. Tyrone Strader. I see you.